little bit of a roll, rolly thing. It feels like you're on a ship. <laughs> got a little bit of roll. Well, we got. Where's it at? Good morning, Quadcopter 101 here. What I got for you today is a review of the Idea Fly F90 Octopus. Looking at the F90 Octopus, you can say, yeah, this is another competitor to the Tiny Whoop. Um, this one looks actually pretty cool. Um, it's kind of like the idea of the octopus. Here's be the octopus head and its cape and its arms, but it's only four-armed, <laughs> not eight-armed octopus. But um, it does come with 8520 motors. Uh, give it plenty of power. You know, it's somewhat ducted fan, although, you know, this... Most ducted fans are a little bit thicker here uh, to uh, smooth out the airstream going through here. We'll see how that actually performs. It comes loaded, uh, available in Free Sky, Fly Sky, and DSM versions. Um, it's loaded with an F3 Evo flight control board, loaded with 3.0.1 beta flight, uh, 40 channel, or is it 48? Ch uh, yeah, 48 channel, 600 TV L camera, 25 milliwatt, and uh, it comes with a beeper. Believe it or not, a beeper is on this thing. And also 2S 300 milliamp hour battery to power it. Now, one thing about this, um, the receivers for these bind of flies, when they come, they are external to the camera or external to the quadcopter. They're just hanging there. Uh, the idea is that it makes it easier to bind the transmitter uh, or the receiver before flying uh, if it's external to this quadcopter. You don't need to pull this top off, in other words. Uh, but once you have it bound, all you do is push it up inside the quad, or inside the quadcopter's canopy here. Uh, just slide it in there and you're ready to go. That's how you do it. So, uh, simple quadcopter, let's give it a flight of the Idea Fly F90 Octopus and see how it flies. Hope you enjoy this flight. We had to move as we got uh, rained on over there. The automatic <laughs> sprinklers came on. Well, we should be fine over here, I hope. Okay, here we go with the F90. And selecting uh, arming, we are armed. And selecting acro, we are in acro. And away we go. So we're going to stay down here just to be safe. Seeing how this performs around here, going around here. There we are down below. And we'll go overhead and do that. <laughs> I can't go too far over that way, folks. That's where the sprinklers are. So we're going to stay on this end here. So you know how maneuverable this thing is. Going over the park side, going around us. Well, you know, this is somewhat maneuverable for a little quadcopter. Okay, again, we're flying acro here. Um, it has a, like a roll to it. Feels kind of like uh, being on a ship. Let's see, I hope I don't get rained on, but I'm going through here anyways. <laughs> around the barrel come by us coming by us again uh, <laughs> losing a little bit of power there probably took too much of a turn but um, yeah I guess it's a good indoor flyer meant for indoor flying I guess I'm flying it outdoors of course I like outdoor flying <laughs> want to see if it could do that it did it over end, end over end loop. Oh, it's starting to get a little wobbly, so my power is probably getting a little bit low now. And I am noticing that I got to give it a lot of more, a lot more power to keep it flying. So let's fly it over in this direction, so my wife can get some good close-ups of it. Fly it slow, bias. So the F90 Octopus. Yeah, it, it's its pits could be fine-tuned a little bit more. It's um, like I said, feels a little wobbly with the stock pit, but that can be fixed with further adjustments. But, you know, the stock pits are flyable, <laughs> which is good. Also, I got a little bit of a breeze starting to pick up here. Maybe that's, a, I'm feeling that also. But I'm still flying. Uh-oh, there goes the beeper. So, we'll bring it in. Oh no, there goes the beeper stop. I'll wait until the beeper beeps a little bit longer. Okay, I guess I should bring it in. Let's get it on the pad. 
Get it on the pad. <laughs> ah, close enough. The <laughs> F90 octopus from Idea Fly. Interesting little quadcopter uh, with an interesting shape. I hope the video came out well. <laughs> I was flying it over there earlier, folks, with a different one. I have actually two of these for flight. But I was flying it over there, and those we were sitting right in front of those sprinklers over there, and the sprinklers came on and doused us real good. But good enough, or luckily I had the second one here, ready to go. So I hope you enjoyed this flight, this quadcopter 101. Signing out.